the joystick system here. If you were to engage the joystick, you can basically choose how powerful you want this joystick to be. So I'm on level four right now. Let's go down to level one. So if you wanted to go full lock to the left now to port, just as I did, you can, you can be quite aggressive with it and you can see the boat isn't going to over manoeuvre in any way. You can, of course, increase the power. Let's go to level five now. You can see there's a bit more power there, but the nice thing about the joystick is it's not too sensitive. So those who are getting into boating um, might want to look at just that feature for making adjustments in a marina, for example, because you know you can not over rev it effectively, um, causing the boat to move too much. Okay guys, so we are now looking to put this um, Primate 21 into its berth. Customer's berth is G5, next to a boat called Rebecca, so let's give it a go. So we've got G, G pontoon here, as you can see. And if you look at the uh, pillar on the left there, there's F, so we need to go in there. So let's see if we can, let's see if we can go in there. So I've turned the engine fully to starboard right now. We're starting to turn, as you can see. Gonna keep that power nice and low. I'm gonna keep this really slow. So you've got to slightly, when you twist the throttle, the, um, sorry, the joystick to turn the engine, you've got to slightly push it forward to engage that forward gear. So now I can see here, you've got the Rebecca boat there, which is a, uh, a levy boat. Just gonna slightly engage some forward just to get us away from these boats here. Again, engine fully to starboard, and I'm gonna push it forward just to bring us away from back the boats here. So we're heading straight into this uh, pontoon here. We're gonna turn the boat a little bit more again. The wind is kind of holding us off the berths right now. So engine fully to starboard, engage the gear again. As you let go of the throttle, the engine goes to, to, to the middle part of the boat again. As you can see, I'm now gonna turn the throttle, to the joystick to the right, turning the engine, bit of forward motion, it's all about little adjustments, really. Yeah, we'll just get right in there, turning the engine to port, a little bit of reverse. There we go, guys. So, Ralph, if you want to step off there. Okay, so that's a wrap for this video where we've documented the value a joystick control system can add to a single Yamaha SBW engine. You can go for the joystick control system with twin Yamaha SBWs as well, which also has some really cool features such as the stay point feature, which basically means when you hit the button on the joystick, the boat will hold its position using forward and reverse with the two engines. And there's also the ability to turn the joystick either to the left or fully to the right, which then allows the boat to literally crab sideways which is really helpful when you're looking to come off alongside pontoons when you might be say pinned to the pontoon when there's a lot of wind and things like that so thank you for watching this video guys and we'll be sure to make a video with the twin outboards and joystick very soon